Welcome back to Inside the Huddle. I'm Mike Joseph, and the Leopards are going to head to West Point this weekend to take on the Army Cadets. A uh, situation where in my junior and senior year, I had a chance to play up there. We lost both games, but they were so close, both within a touchdown. It is a fantastic place to play. I don't think you'll see any better place in the fall, especially mid-October, to play than Mikey Stadium. A big opportunity for the Leopards. They're going to need to stop the run. And this week, against the triple option, you must stay balanced and disciplined. Triple option basically means that the quarterback has the opportunity to carry the ball along with the fullback and on the fly or what we call orbit motion, the backside or front side running back. So the triple option being guarding against the midline, having the quarterback on the, the option and then the pitch man. So you get one, two, three or the triple option. You need to be balanced. Whether the Lafayette Leopards come out in a simple balanced set, Army will line up with two wide receivers, two wings, and a fullback balanced across. You must be balanced here as well. So the play between the nose and the tackle is very important. Taking on that double team here and allowing the backers to flow. This man will come upfield, and there's your option player. Needs to be disciplined. He's going to have to come down the line, take on the dive, and being able to come up and take the quarterback and running the alley with your free safety or your corner with your safety over the top. So this week, the discipline, the balance, Lafayette needs to stay balanced, whether they move over and bump a little bit based upon the orbit or fly motion comes from one side or the other. You'll see the free safety and maybe the willy, but a 4-4 coming out of the 4-2-5, a 4-4 look, staying nice and balanced, making sure that your quarterback and your pitch players are disciplined take on the low block. Or you may see Lafayette do a little bit of 3-4 defense. Now, the play of the nose guard, again, extremely important. If he can take on that one-on-one -on -one block and be a factor on the dive, Andy Davidson, from right down the road here in the Lehigh Valley, Emmaus High School, been a fantastic runner. So you must stop the fullback first, then the quarterback down the line. Again, balance, head up, head up, head up. Being able to move with the fly motion or the orbit motion, and then having these safeties and these corners come up and make tackles. Discipline also in the secondary when they pull it, come back, and maybe a wheel and a post. Situations that are big plays. They don't throw it a lot, but when they do throw it, a lot of times you're going to find wide open receivers when we stare into the backfield. And the last point I want to bring up is read key and avoid the big play. This tackle right here, take a look at that tackle. If he comes upfield to get the mic backer, it is run. So very important for the corners and the safeties. Read through the tackle. If he pass pros and they turn everything back, that is pass. Get into your drops, whether you're playing quarters or halves or inverted or whatever. But reading through that offensive tackle, he goes downfield. Obviously, it has to be a run. Can't be downfield on a running play. If he pass sets, Make sure that your reads and your keys are followed. You cannot stare into the backfield. Discipline, good play up front by the nose guard and tackle. Read your keys, avoid the big play. Lafayette must stop the triple option this week at West Point.